Neighbors in Yukon looking for justice, they've become victims of numerous car break-ins. But now one neighbor is fighting back. News 9's Carl Torp joins us live with a story new at 5. Carl, update us. Yeah, this neighbor hopes that his surveillance video sends a strong message to any would-be thief that they are being watched. It's, it's sad. It's frustrating. Camera Whaley had had enough. We've had vehicles uh, broken into about uh, three or four times. So he recently installed surveillance cameras at his Yukon home. This week, the church pastor played police detective when he noticed this. Footprints in the wet grass one morning leading to his truck. It was time to check the recording. Sure enough, at 430 in the morning, it looks like a vehicle drops off a, uh, at least one individual and he uh, comes up to my truck and starts looking in with a flashlight. The guy doesn't break in. The truck door is locked. But next door, that same morning, neighbors found this, a truck door which had been opened. That's one of our leading crimes that, that happened here in our jurisdiction. And one reason, Lieutenant Ron Matthews says more homeowners are investing in their own surveillance. It definitely is on the upswing. Especially in Whaley's neighborhood. A lot of them are excited about it and asking me about the brand, make and model of the uh, surveillance so that they can install it themselves. And try to catch a would-be criminal in the act. Big adrenaline rush, uh, actually finding somebody that's trying to invade your privacy, invade your, your personal space. And Whaley's surveillance system cost a few hundred dollars. He has given that video over to police. Carl Torp, News 9. All right, Carl, police want to remind all of us that thieves will rarely break out a window to get into a car. Instead, they go for the unlocked cars first.